is today's TMJ4, live at 10. Now at 10, President Donald Trump schedules a visit to southeastern Wisconsin this week. Good evening, I'm Tom Durian. Katie is off tonight. The White House says the president will visit Snap-on Tools in Kenosha Tuesday. It is the president's first trip to Wisconsin since taking office in January. Ricky Mitchell is here. She spoke with neighbors around the company's headquarters about the security preparations they've seen. Ricky. Well, Tom, the Snap-on corporate offices sit in a residential area of Kenosha, so there are homes on almost all sides. Many neighbors knew something was going on yesterday when they saw military aircraft flying overhead kind of scare us. We were at a birthday party. Rosie Barajas lives across the street from Snap on. She says she saw five military aircraft fly over her house Saturday afternoon. It's like, is it the end of the world? <laughs> what is it? Yeah, is it the military coming over here or what? <laughs> These photos, courtesy of Jonathan Smith in Kenosha, show what appear to be U.S. Marine Corps aircraft flying over Snap on. The White House confirmed that President Donald Trump will make remarks at the Snap-on headquarters on Tuesday. Another neighbor who spoke off camera says he noticed recently these semi-trucks repositioned around the border of Snap-on's parking lot. Residents have also noticed a higher police presence in the parking lot and along their streets. According to the company's website, Snap-on makes and markets tools and software systems for various industries like aviation, agriculture, construction and the military. The company was founded in 1920 and currently has an annual revenue of $3.4 billion. According to a news release on its website, Snap-on will release 2017 first quarter results on Thursday, though it's unclear if that has anything to do with President Trump's visit. And we've also learned that a local left wing organization called Forward Kenosha is planning to protest at Snap-on Tuesday in response to President Trump's visit. Tom. All right, Ricky, thanks. And President Trump last visited Wisconsin in December when he spoke in West Dallas as part of a thank you tour. A scheduled visit to Harley Davidson in February was canceled at the last minute. Vice President Mike Pence visited Janesville in March. And today's TMJ4 and today's TMJ4.com will keep you updated with the latest on the president's Kenosha visit this week.